Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for March 20th of 2022. Well, it is titled a picturesque equinox sunset. So what do we see here? Well, here we see the sun setting off in the distance and directly in front of this road. So it looks like it's setting directly along the road, which means that we're looking out towards the west since this is sunset and a lot of roads do run north, south or east, west. So if we're looking at an east, west road right now, we would see the sun rise right along the road or set right along the road. And that is because we are at the equinox and that is the day of equal day time and equal night time. So it's the day we have 12 hours of daylight and 12 hours of darkness. Now the equinox is also the beginning of spring and it occurs when the sun crosses the celestial equator. So the vernal equinox is when the sun crosses the celestial equator from the southern hemisphere of the sky into the northern hemisphere of the sky. And what we note of course is that the days will get longer and longer and we've been noticing that, that the amount of daylight is longer and longer since the mid since the middle of December and is now getting longer and we also notice that the sun is going to be getting higher and higher in the sky. So if you note the shadow of an object cast around noon, you would see that in December, it's a very long shadow. And at other times, we would get a very short shadow in the summer. So right now we're kind of in between that. But if we look at those shadows, we will see things continually get shorter and shorter and shorter over the next few months as we head toward the solstice. So the solstice will be about in about three months from now in June. Now this is not the only equinox of the year. There will actually be a second one and that will occur in September. In September, the sun will also cross the celestial equator, this time going from the northern hemisphere of the sky to the southern. And at that point in the fall, the sun is continually getting lower and lower in the sky and the days are getting shorter and shorter. However, you would get a very similar picture were you to take this in in September as we do as with the image taken that we're looking at today. And this one is not from this equinox which does occur today but was from actually from seven years ago in March of 2015. But a similar event occurs every year about this time with any roads that run east and west such as the one we're looking at today. So that was our picture of the day for March 20th of 2022. It was titled A Picturesque Equinox Sunset. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be every single day last year. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.